going on, everybody? Hope you're all having a great day. Um, it's a big Tuesday, big slate, a lot to go through, but I'm going to try and do it as fast as possible. I will be live at 530 Eastern time and we're running a little late this morning. So we're going to get this one out as soon as I can. Uh, the teams that I'm the, the, the pitchers that I'm using the most on DraftKings are Verlander, Robbie Ray, Plezak, and Justin Steele. I will also be mixing in some Cortez, Quintana, Pavetta, Gray, and Morton. I'm just getting a little bit creative and, and, and some Dylan C's as well. I think I don't think there's a huge gap on some of the top end pitchers today. And I think that the ownership will reflect that there is let will look like there is a huge gap. So I'm gonna be playing a lot of them, but the highest owned will be Ray, Verlander. Please, Zach, and Steel for me personally. Uh, the ownership for the stacks, I am highest on Toronto, but there's a lot of ways to go today. There's nobody that really stands out as like an, oh, you need to play this stack type of a lineup. So I like I like the Toronto first. I really like Cleveland. I really like Minnesota, and I really like Chicago, the Cubs. Um, I also think that you can make an argument for Washington, Atlanta, Texas, and Boston. But I'm going to focus more on the first four, uh, Toronto, Cleveland, Minnesota, Chicago Cubs. And then the Oakland value is something that I'm going to get some exposure to as well. They're just really, really cheap, and you can get a little mini stack going really easily. Uh, Vlad is my highest owned player currently right now. Oh, the other thing I mentioned, I, I didn't mention, is I, I like a little Seattle stack, a mini stack. You get Hanniger, France. You could use Casale as a catcher. Uh, you could use really anybody else. You could also use Santana at first base instead of France because he's 2,500. Um, so that's what I'm mostly doing there. Uh, at catcher, Kirk is my most highest as my highest owned with Contreras just behind him. Second base, uh, mostly it's going to be stacks, but Simeon stands out price wise on both sites, uh, both FanDuel and DraftKings. Uh, it's 41 and 2400. And uh, Merrifield in your Blue Jays stacks, Jimenez in your in your Cleveland stacks. If not Jimenez, you can go ahead and use uh, Owen Miller if you need the savings. And then you've got Madrigal, who should be leading off for the Cubs at 2,500, is sort of the standout play. Then you get, you know, Cesar Hernandez in a, in a Washington stack, uh, Glaber in maybe a mini Yankee stack, uh, Luis Arias in your uh, Minnesota stacks. Third base, uh, Devers, Miranda, Suarez, and Chapman are the guys I'm using the most. Shortstop, Bichette is my highest stone by far with Rosario behind him. Uh, then it gets to O'Neill Cruz, Bogarts, and Seeger, who I have all about similar. The value for the A's that I mentioned in the outfield, Pinder, Bolt, Stevenson, all 2K. Uh, that's some interesting value that you could add. I love Mitch Hanniger tonight. Uh, I like J-Rod in, a, again, either a Seattle stack or a mini stack. Uh, Dolas Garcia in your Texas tax. Uh, obviously, if you can get to uh, Springer and Teoscar Hernandez, it followed by Gurriel for the Toronto stacks. Suzuki, Hap, and Fran Mill Reyes. Reyes being really cheap at 2.9 and 2.7K, uh, respectively. So that's sort of just a quick rundown of what I'm doing. Again, going to be live at 5 Eastern. Um, and I did post all my early builds on TrueDFS.com. Also made a really nice video with Evan uh, that shows you how to use some TrueDFS tools, especially the uh, DFS, uh, you know, pulling the industry and seeing what everyone else thinks. I think it's a tool that everybody should really use. So check out that video. I think it's about 15 minutes long. And I think it's really useful for TrueDFS users or people who are considering using TrueDFS. So I will be live at 5.30 Eastern. This is a quick one, uh, but we will be uh, we will be live for the regular time, but it'll be well, for the regular amount of time, but it will be at 5.30 Eastern today uh, as I have something at six. So let's get it tonight, guys. Uh, good luck to everyone out there. And let's uh, let's make some money. Let's see some big screenshots. Rody almost took down this tournament last week, came in second. Maybe this week uh, one of us takes it down. So Good. And uh, anybody else in the 111, good luck to you. And hopefully uh, you guys come in uh, either first, second or third and me and Rody are right there with you. Anyway, good luck to everyone tonight and we'll hopefully see you at the top of the leaderboards. Good luck, everybody.